Hi everybody, my name is Chris Donovan. I'm a sales associate with Lightspeed Financial Services Group. In today's video, we're going to be looking at some basic functions of Lightspeed Trader's charting window. To start, go ahead and right click on the chart itself. Find and click on the Show Toolbar button. You'll see here now, at the top of the window, you will have all these wonderful buttons you can click to add studies to the chart. The toolbar makes life easier than it would be if you had to go into the settings menu every time you wanted to add a particular study to your chart. The tools that are ready for immediate use are the solid ray, dash segment, dotted extended, delete selected lines, simple moving average 30, the toggle button to show volume, and show summaries button. If you'd like to add more buttons to the toolbar, go ahead and right click on the chart again. Open up the settings menu. You can access this by mousing over and left clicking on the settings option from the menu. Alternatively, you can click on the gear in the upper right hand corner of the window to bring up the settings for the chart too. If you click on the tools tab, you will see on the left hand side toolbar. From the drop down menu is a selection of other studies and their buttons you can add to the toolbar. You can customize the type of line, the thickness of the line, what color you'd like the toolbar button and the study to be when it appears on your chart. To show your active orders, executed orders, positions, or canceled orders, click again on the drop down menu under the toolbar section on the left. Select one of those options, click the Add button, click OK, then click on the newly added button to toggle displaying your active order on the chart. A neat feature of the chart is that once you have enabled the display of active orders, you can click and drag the line to adjust the price of your order. Keep in mind that doing this will cancel the previous order you had made. Now the solid line, which was our active order, has become a dotted line. This indicates your position. The green dot on the line indicates your execution. If you mouse over it, it will show you the execution price for your order. Another way to add studies to your toolbar is through the Studies tab. Click on the Studies tab. Under the Add Study column in the middle of the Settings window, there is a selection of studies you may choose from in the drop-down menu. To add this particular study to your toolbar, Simply click the Add to Toolbar button at the bottom of the column. To add your selected study to the chart, click the Add button in the right-hand column. If you'd like to change or add parameters for your chart, such as the time period, go ahead and open up the settings again. Make sure this time the Chart Parameters tab is selected. Under the Params section, there is a drop down menu with different chart intervals available for you to choose from. To add one of these options to the tabs at the bottom of the charting window, select the parameters you would like, then on the right hand side under the Buttons section, enter a name for the new tab, and click the Add button. Click OK to exit the settings window. This chart 
with the parameters you selected should now be available to you at the bottom of the chart window. If you'd like to include pre and post market hours to your chart, go back into the settings window, select the chart you'd like to add this to from the list of choices on the right. Next, go to the Param section of the Chart Parameters tab and click on the 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. option. This will now display pre and post market hours on your chart for this specific tab. Click OK when finished. Lastly, if you'd like to scroll in or out of your chart, use the mouse scroll wheel. To scroll up or down on the chart, hold control while scrolling with the mouse wheel. To scroll left and right, click and drag the x-axis. The highlighted section also indicates the period of time that is pre and post market. That's all for now. Thanks for joining me and have a great day.